Hello, in this video I'm gonna explain you how to do a list comprehension. Welcome to Make Sense, my name is Rick. Before we get started, please check out the other videos on our channel and like and subscribe. So for this video I'm gonna use a list of objects, in this case it's a credits list, it's a list of credits and you can see each and every object has a credit ID, title, release date, job, so just basic information and what we're gonna do is we're gonna get a specific title then from each and every object and make it into a new list and that goes like this I'm going to go over each part of this uh, code so first you need to use the list so the credits list we're talking about then we uh, use our four credit in credits list. So we define a variable that's going to stand in for each object that's in the list. We set the result. So for the result of this, we just want the title from each object. And we define a variable that's going to be used as the new list. And when we look at the resulting list, we will see then that we just have just a list with all the titles, uh, as you can see here. What we can also include in our code is a condition, because for instance, the credits of the previous one also includes uh, directing, producing credits. And we may have doubles that way. And maybe we just want to see only the uh, director credits. So how do we do that? We uh, make a, uh, we add the condition. I'm going to show you how to do that here. And you basically do that within the list comprehension, but underneath the four credit and credits list, we add our condition. We start with our if. And then um, basically we use the variable that we used to loop over everything. We use that to create a Boolean expression. So in this case, we say credit job equals director. And which means that we will in our results, we will only have the uh, objects where the job is director and if we look at the resulting list then we will see that there are still just the titles but there are less titles and it will only be the titles of films that had the job directed you can find the code for this example and others on our github i'll put a link in the description you can also check out the other videos on our channel we are making a playlist with other videos like this on list operations so you can check that one out if you want to support us you can buy us a coffee on buymecoffee.com you can use our code for scripts or data quest you can find the links in the description thank you for watching this video and i hope i'll see you on the next one goodbye